Gold Assembly, Flamenco Fusion, and they are sent home from that 1200 meter marker. Glastonbury did not get the best of starts away. Let's fly high as well. Sword of Truth, though, was quick into stride. Races alongside Materin on the inside. In behind those then was Flamenco Fusion, Golden Assembly, also shaken up in the early stages. On the right-hand side of the screens is Strong Blonde. That's racing in the club colors, all black. Races alongside Sharian. Zeta is also right up there. Races alongside on that grandstand side rail. So they come up now to the 600 meter marker. It's out in front there, Sharian, who leads. From in behind that then, Looks like Zeta in behind those was young Antoine racing alongside that one there. Looks like Prince Fireball on the extreme far side of the runners. Looks like Let's Fly High is also improved now to race about two lengths off of the leader as they come up now to the 300 meter marker. It's young Antoine who goes in front. Young Antoine keeps on striding in behind those. Then looks like Materin is struggling on the far side of runners there. Looks like Let's Fly High has switched positions. It's now Let's Fly High who picked it up from in behind those. Zeta is bunching about all over the track here and then as they drive up to the line it's super challenge who gets there from in behind that zeta and on the far side of runners was glastonbury number one super challenge goes on to score but as i say that the race review hooter sounds there was a lot of bunching in the final furlong Super challenge though provisionally will get the result from back in second Zeta third will go to Glastonbury numbers you will need one five two wait for the judges